Oh my god, hi, what's up? Did somebody say self-care night? I actually canceled all my plans for Saturday night to have this self-care night with you. And I'm very excited about it. It is so needed. I just feel like I've had such a chaotic week. Got my wallet stolen. And everyone deserves to pamper themselves. You should do a self-care night with me. We can like do it together. Wait. I'm literally so rude. If you're new here, hi, my name is Anna and you should definitely subscribe, join my little friend group here. Let's get into some self-care, guys. Now, before we start, we have a couple crucial parts to this, okay? Step one, you are going to go jam some music of your choice. I will be playing Taylor Swift. Step two, you are going to put on a mood lighting. We do not want to see any overhead lighting, especially at nighttime. This is the light that I love from Amazon and there's so many different colors you can put it on. You can mess around with it. It also has different settings so you can put it on <laughs> like this. What's this gonna do? There's so many things this light does. Another option I love is I do this all the time. You can search on YouTube aesthetic aura and so many of these will come up. I just play it on my TV. I just think it's such a vibe. It looks cute. And step three, we are going to pick up our area because we need to start off with a clean base. It doesn't have to be perfect, but we deserve a clean area. It makes it more like stress free. Now that we got that done, we are going to move on to hair. Do a little hair mask, hair everything before we take a shower. My hair is so oily right now. <laughs> it's so oily, I feel like I could make a basket of fries. It needs a wash so bad. When it's oily though, it's so fun to like brush through because it's so smooth. That's so disgusting, I'm sorry. So this is what I'm using for my hair today. We have first my little concoction I made of rosemary oil and Jehovah oil, which helps your hair growth so much. I also use this Grow Hair Serum from Vega more. And then the Olaplex number three. I gotta start off by dampening my hair for this Olaplex mask. Now you can't tell if it's oil or water. This is my little homemade mixture and I spray it into the roots of my hair. Also, this stuff smells so good. Like it makes my whole bathroom smell really good. Oh, it leaked on me. Okay, we're having some technical difficulties. What is going on here? So I spray it right here on this part of my hairline because I feel like from having like a ponytail as a child, it just kind of made me lose hair. So we're gonna do that on both sides. This side's even worse. I don't know why, but I'm trying to like regrow that hair right there. And then I'm going to add the next little oil here just for hair growth. I'm going to put some on the scalp and the same spots I just did right there, just all throughout the scalp. Really want to get it everywhere. But the most important part of this is taking a scalp massager brush. You can get these on Amazon and rubbing it into your scalp, like really getting those oils in there so that they can work. And now I am going to use the Olaplex mask. This makes my hair feel really soft. Gonna put it all over the ends of my hair. I definitely had the most damage at the ends, obviously. And then I'm going to put my hair into a little bun and let that sit in the meanwhile. Let all the product absorb. A little slick back bun, except not so slick. <laughs> Just like that. So while I let this masterpiece sit in my hair for probably like 30 minutes, I think I'm gonna color. I've talked about this before, but I just think it's so important to have hobbies and like be creative. You know, everybody needs a creative outlet and you do not have to be good at your hobbies. So this is mine of choice. I've been loving this lately. I got these oil pastels and I just draw like I'm literally a kindergartner. <laughs> like literally just drawing for fun. It does not have to be good. <laughs> this is what I do while I was watching the Super Bowl waiting for Rihanna because like I don't understand football. Shine bright like a diamond. Here's another little random one I did. I've been experimenting with oil pastels. Once again, it's not good, but it's fun. <laughs> and I think I'm also going to order takeout because I'm really hungry and it's dinner time. I'm going to DoorDash me some food. Honestly, I need a DoorDash club because I actually use DoorDash an unhealthy amount that I do not want to admit. I'm not proud to admit it, but like I do. Specifically Papa John's, I don't know what it is. I love Papa John's, okay? I'm not even kidding you. I probably get that at least four times a week, debatably more. Go order my Papa John's. I always get the same thing. We're getting the Oreo bites, the extra dipping sauce, the 14 inch thin cheese pizza. The thin is so much better. I'm so hungry, that is gonna be so good. Now I'm gonna get to coloring while this sits in my hair. <laughs> the cutest little page of strawberries like yes it's so ratchet but at the same time i think it's the cutest thing ever this is your sign to go get creative even if you're bad at it okay i preach this all the time and i won't stop so my little masterpiece isn't she just beautiful 
<laughs> and now I'm going to take my everything shower, wash this out, but I have a, like a specific routine, I guess, for my everything shower, if you'll call it that. I'm kind of curious like what order you guys go in because personally, this is my little order. I start with washing my hair and then I deep condition and I'll leave the conditioner in for like the rest of the shower. I just put, put it up in like something like that. Then I exfoliate so that I can shave. I wash my whole body and then I wash my face. And then at the very end, I'll rinse out that conditioner and everything with cold water. I feel like it just makes my skin and my hair feel so good. So that's my little routine. I'm going to go take my shower now and I'm so excited about it. I feel so like crusty right now. I just got out of the shower and that was much needed. I feel so much better already. And we're gonna brush through this tangly hair. My hair gets like knotted so easily. Also, my stomach is like growling. I'm so hungry. I think my food is almost here, or I hope it is. I try to be gentle with my hair, but I'm just not. I like go through it. And then I'm gonna use this way leave-in conditioner. I feel like it makes my hair soft, so I use it. I'm just gonna put it on the ends. I think I am just going to let my hair air dry tonight because I'm too lazy to blow dry it, honestly. But what I wanna do is those overnight heatless curls with like the robe thing. But I am gonna give my hair a little to help it dry. My hair takes a long time to like dry though on its own. It smells so good. Like all those products just, oh, I'm obsessed. So my next dilemma is my food's gonna be here in like 10 or 15 minutes. I really wanna start like my face mask and stuff. I don't wanna go downstairs to pick up the food with my full like face mask shebang on. Cause I feel like that defeats the purpose. I think I'm gonna wait. My Papa John's has delivered. I'm not gonna lie. I already dug into it. I was so hungry. But I wanna show you guys. These are so incredibly good. This is, I've literally already eaten so many. Here are these Oreo bites from Papa John's and they are the best thing I've ever had. And it comes with this little like icing dipping sauce. They are just so good. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Mm. They're so good. My pizza. Absolutely amazing. I'm so happy. Treat yourselves. Like food is meant to the sirens, oh my god. Anyways, what I was saying is honor your cravings because food is meant to be enjoyed, not earned. If you are craving pizza, go eat the pizza, okay? That's, that's my words of advice. You deserve it. I'm finally done munching and we are going to get to the skincare part, which is always fun. But first, I've been loving these. So these are like the two body care products I'm using right now. They're both from Glossier because I just love the smell of this. I also have the Glossier U perfume. It smells so good. I get so many compliments on it. This is just a body oil. I like to put it on my arms. It makes me feel like a glazed donut, which is the goal, right? The little noise it makes. Can you guys hear that? <laughs> I would do my legs, but I'm in sweatpants and like cold. Um, and then this is just the lotion that I'm gonna put on top of that. If I could only have like one scent for the rest of my life, it would be this one. Now we are moisturized and glowing, like little glazed donuts. However, I have three face masks to decide from. This one's my all-time favorite, but I use it all the time. So I'm like, should I try a new one? I kind of want to, I feel like I want to try the pineapple. Let's, oh. You guys see that? I feel like I need to pull my hair back. I'm gonna use these clips to pull my hair back so it doesn't get in the mask. I love these clips so much. My TV's like trying to hypnotize me right now. We'll get back to that. I love me a good face mask. You know what I should have done in this video is went and got my nails done. They're so crusty. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow. Oh, I'm struggling. Oh, okay, wait, did I get it? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, it already feels so good, okay. It doesn't like smell like pineapple or anything. What makes this pineapple? Fit it to the face here. Ew, I need to like stretch the eyeballs. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> I always eat these. It doesn't taste like pineapple. Comment down below if you are still watching to this point what your zodiac sign is. And let's see if we have any zodiac twins. I'm a Taurus. Full chart. I'm a Taurus sun, Taurus moon, and Leo rising. So I'm very self-care and food driven, clearly, as we can tell by this video. Please! Do you guys want to see how dumb I look trying to like get a thumbnail picture here? I feel like I don't know how to take selfies. There should honestly be a class on this. My forehead looks so big. <gasps> That's, that is terrifying. Okay, wait. How did the girlies do this? Good. I think someone's like having a street fight down there. But I also have these teeth whiteners that I can use. So we are going to whiten the teeth. My shiny teeth in me. My shiny teeth that twinkle. I think of that song anytime I whiten my teeth. Let's do the top chompers first. Literally, how does this little strip whiten your teeth? I don't understand. I look so cute. I look like a bunny. 
Ah, where did it go? Oh, here it is. Oh my god, face mask. I need you to like stay down. Now I'm ready. I think. Oh, now there's hair on it. Ew, we do not want that. Oh my god, yeah. I'm so struggling. Is it on? I can't tell him. Okay. The face mask is really getting in the way here. Oh my gosh. Okay. What's going on? What is going on? Got the pearly lights going. How long do I leave this one now? In the meantime, I think I want to find a movie to watch. Monte Carlo. Low key, maybe. Maybe. It's kind of hard to talk with these in my mouth, so I'm sorry. But face mask is done, so I'm now going to move on to these eye patches. They are so good. They make my eyes feel like not really puffy and swollen. I actually do this like every morning before I do my makeup a lot of times. It just feels so good on my eyes. Now we're going to let these boys sit on my eye bag. I want these off my teeth. I can't talk. Eh, maybe those are the best for all of us. My shiny teeth and me. I got to take these out now. Ah, there we go. Okay. Oh my god. Already so much better. How they look. Okay, we can also go ahead and take these off. Feeling better. We already feeling better. And now, my friends, we get to top this off with some skincare. This is the best moisturizer literally on the planet. I've gone through two full things of these. It's the Pharmacy Honey Halo. It just feels so good on my skin. And I have dry skin, so I need all the moisturizer I can get. I love taking my gua sha. This thing completely sculpts your face. I just take it just like this. I don't know. There's like videos you can watch on like TikTok and YouTube on how to do this probably better than me. I try to do this every single day because when I'm consistent with it, I definitely notice a difference. But I just drag it up my skin. That is what I'm doing for tonight. Oh, it dropped. I actually kind of want to show you guys my view because I have the most gorgeous view and now the sun won't like block the lighting. I love my view so much. It's so pretty. I have this like city view. And now I have like the best lighting going. I have my TV like trying to hypnotize me. I was playing my aesthetic aura and then this just came on and I think they're trying to hypnotize me. But like it's kind of cool so I'm like leaving it on. Is this not such a vibe? Well I'm going to watch a movie and probably go to bed but I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and did some self care yourself because you deserve it. I promise you that. And if you like this video you should give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more of me because I know you want that. But I love you all so much and I hope you're having a beautiful amazing day and I'll see you in the next video bye okay but what's prettier the view or me me just sitting here like watching the tv okay I gotta go <laughs>